Hello everyone, and welcome back to Kingdom Hearts Final Mix. Last episode, we uh, started um, our adventure. Um, went around, beat up some kids, uh, got our ass handed to us multiple times, and uh, you know, just overall had a good time. But, um, I did notice that the audio, my, my voice, could not be heard as well, and I realized that's because I was wearing my mic wrong, because I'm a complete idiot. So I'm hoping that is fixed this episode, um, if not, then, uh, FML, <laughs> but, um, either way, let's just, uh, get into it. So we got all the stuff for the raft. So we gotta go talk to Kyrie. Speak. Thanks, Sora. I found something today, too. Here, it's yours. High potion. After all the fights I did yesterday, I think I have plenty of potions. Tired? Wanna call it a day? Yeah, let's go home. Okay, it is getting late. We'll finish up tomorrow. So, Kyrie's home is out there somewhere, right? Could be. We'll never know by staying here. But how far could a raft take us? Who knows? If we have to, we'll think of something else. So... Yeah, I'm sure if, you know, you don't make it to where you're going on this raft of yours, <laughs> you know, after you've ran out of food, you're stranded in the middle of the ocean. Yeah, yeah, you'll think of something else, I'm sure. You won't uh, just uh, flat up die. Suppose you get to another world. <laughs> what would you do there? Hmm. Well, I, I haven't really thought about it. It's just, I've always wondered why we're here on this island, if there are any other worlds out there. Why did we end up on this one? And suppose there are other worlds. Then ours is just a little piece of something much greater. So, we could have just as easily ended up somewhere else, right? I don't know. Exactly. That's why we need to go out there and find out. Just sitting here won't change a thing. It's the same old stuff. So let's go. You've been thinking a lot lately, haven't you? Thanks to you. If you hadn't come here, I probably would have never thought of any of this. Kari, thanks. You're welcome. Sora! You wanted one, didn't you? A palpoo fruit? If two people share one, their destinies become intertwined. They'll remain a part of each other's lives, no matter what. Come on, I know you want to try it. What are you talking? Now, who's ready for a Disney uh, break commercial? And there's the useless piece of shit himself. <laughs> I'm kidding, I actually really love Donald, but he is pretty useless in the Kingdom Hearts series.
Now, if you were a magical uh, duck and your best friend was sleeping and wouldn't wake up, how would you wake him up? I'll give you a minute to think about it. Got it? Okay, let's see how Donald handles the situation. He strikes Goofy with a freaking lightning bolt. Goofy's lucky he isn't dead. <laughs> hey there, Donald. Good morning. We've got a problem, Goofy. But don't tell anyone. Ooh. Queen Minnie? Not even the queen. Daisy? No! It's top secret. Oh, good morning, ladies. What? Yeah, that's right, Donald. <laughs> that's right. <clears throat> All right, so I'll talk to him, but I'm not fine with him. Heard about the legendary power of the Palpu fruit? They say, if you share it with someone you really care for, it binds you together forever and ever, through eternity. <sighs> it's so romantic. I gotta try it sometime. <laughs> uh, let's see. That's right. Walk up. Wait. No. So, uh, I already know what I need for this level. Park, whatever you want to call it. So I'll just go ahead and uh, collect those. Alright. <clears throat> Me and Titus, we are gonna do a little exploring today. You know, to the secret place at the base of that tree. There's gotta be something there, yeah? Yeah? Who's there? I've come to see the door to this world. Huh? This world has been connected. Well, what are you talking about? Tied to the darkness. Soon to be completely eclipsed. Well, whoever you are, stop freaking me out like this. Huh? Well, well where did you come from? You do not yet know what lies beyond the door. So you're from another world. There is so very much to learn. You understand so little. Oh yeah? Well you'll see. I'm gonna get out and learn what's out there. A meaningless effort. One who knows nothing can understand nothing. Well, no shit. <laughs> and 
nothing really out of the ordinary. How do you get here? Hold on. Oh, guess it just says that. Just one of the dialogue. Oh well. Eh. Honestly, this isn't usually where I'm trying to cook up lots of whatever. Not as well. Oh, this isn't getting annoying at all. <laughs> if I don't get another one soon, I'll just give up. I want to check down here just in case it does drop one good. Okay, I'm trying the other tree. I think you've gotten stronger, but odds are you're still no match for Riku. We took him on three to one last time, and he whipped us all. Well, yeah, I guess Kairi can always count on him. Yeah, like uh, how I kind of whooped y'all guys' asses yesterday. I mean, after getting my ass whipped myself. But we don't talk about that part. Finally, I think I don't really need to. Alright, now we gotta talk to the dickhead over here. Hey Sora, our rascal needs an aid. Let's see. How about Hyrule? What would you call it? Oh, uh, what am I gonna call it? How about the usual? Let's do it. You guys at it again. Alright, I'll be the judge. The usual rules apply. Take any route you want. First one to if catch I that win, tree and make it back here wins. Uh, I'm captain. And if you win, I get to share the power food with Kyrie. Huh? Deal? The winner gets to share a pow poo with Kyrie. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, on my count. Alright. So there are a few tricks you can do here to uh, help ensure your victory. If you're good, crap, I wasn't good. <laughs> if you're good, you can uh, step on that plank and jump off immediately. You'll be able to continue, but Riku will fall and uh, help you out a little. I 
wasn't good enough. Oh, what? No! Oh no. Really? L let, let YouTubers curse at it again? Please tell me it fell. Did he not fall? He didn't fall, did he? Well, I fell, so, uh... It's over for me, <laughs> folks. Oh, I can't believe this. No, Riku, why? Why you do this? I never lose that race. <laughs> Name in the rap island. Fine, have your stupid name. I don't care if I am beating you at this rate. And this is not gonna turn into like how it was yesterday, okay, Riku? I am not going to lose to you over and over and over again. That, this is what was supposed to happen last time. There we go. Ah, Alright, moving on. If I can pull this off, uh, here's something pretty cool you can do. So you're supposed to push this boulder out of the way and go into the cave, but watch this. If I can... Really? No! Almost! I almost did that first try. Well, second try. It's very precise. There we go. You can just destroy the boulder. You ain't even gotta push it, just destroy it. Um, so, basically what happens is the game thinks you're stuck there, even though you uh, can move out and be free if you want, but the game thinks you're stuck there, so, in, so it'll just destroy the rock in order to free you. <laughs> so it's actually uh, a master of... Uh, Physical matter. <laughs> Today we collect provisions for our trip. Let's see. Sora, you're looking for one seagull egg, three mushrooms, two coconuts, three fish. I fill this up with drinking water, but not from the ocean. Bring everything back here if you need help with that. So, wow, you did like off this time. <laughs> Just kidding. Let's see. What's still missing? Fresh drinking water, not salt water, okay? I'm counting on you. So, I think what the game wants you to do is go all the way back to the other side of the island. Get fresh drinking water there, but there's actually fresh drinking water right here. This? I'm making a necklace of falafel shells. In the old days, sailors always wore falafel shells. They were supposed to ensure a safe voyage. See this? It's a charm to help us find each other if we ever get separated. The three of us will always be together. 
Thanks. Sora, I found something today. Two, here, it's yours. Hi, Potion. Tired? Wanna call it a day? Yeah, let's go home. Okay, tomorrow's a big day. We should rest up. You know, Riku has changed. What do you mean? Well... Hmm. You okay? Sora! Let's take the raft and go! Just the two of us! Huh? <laughs> Just kidding! What's gotten into you? You're the one that's changed, Kairi. Maybe. You know, I was a little afraid at first. But now I'm ready! No matter where I go or what I see, I know I can always come back here. Right? Yeah, of course. That's good. Sora, don't ever change. Huh? I just can't wait. Once we set sail, it'll be great. Oh god. Now I gotta try and do the Mickey voice. Oh. I, I I apologize to everyone watching. <clears throat> Boom. Oh good lord. Donald! <laughs> what the fuck? Oh good lord. How do you do a Mickey voice? Sorry. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Sorry. Sorry. No, I, I ain't doing it. No, screw that. Screw that. Sorry to rush off without saying goodbye, but there's big trouble brewing. Not sure why, but the stars have been blinking out one by one, and that means disaster can't be far behind. I hate to leave you all, but I've got to check into it. There's someone with the key. The key to our survival. So I need you and Goofy to find him and stick with him. Got it? This is... I mean... You know, if the fact I was trying to do a Mickey voice doesn't make it very clear. Mickey, Mickey Mouse uh, wrote this note. We need that key or we're doomed. So go to Traverse Town and find Leon. He'll point you in the right direction. P.S. Would you apologize to Minnie for me? Thanks, pal. Oh dear, what could this mean? It means we'll just have to trust the king. Gorge, I sure hope he's all right. Yeah, I guess. Don't worry, we'll find the king and the key. Thank you, both of you. Dash it, can you take care of them? Of course. You be careful now, both of you. Oh, and to chronicle your travels, he will accompany you. Over here! Cricket's the name. Jiminy Cricket at your service. We hope for your safe return. Please, help the king. Goofy thought he was slick, huh? Gorge, Jiminy! Your world disappeared, too? It was terrible. We were scattered. And as far as I can see, I'm the only one who made it to this castle. Goofy! Oh, right! I got you. You mean while we're in other worlds, we can't let on where we're from, huh? We gotta protect the world border. Right, world order. <laughs> oh, I guess we'll need new duds when we get there, huh?
Just look at all that <laughs> mercy. Oh, never mind. When you try and make a joke, it just doesn't work. Wait, once we set sail, it'll be great. A storm? Oh no, the raft! Sora, dinner's ready, come on down. Sora? <laughs> and that's the last we'll ever see of uh, Sora's mom. <laughs> that's not even a joke. <laughs> We don't even see her, we just hear her. If at the end of Kingdom Hearts 3 you don't see Sora's mom, I'm gonna be very disappointed. Riku's boat! And Kairi's! Speaking of... Uh, I'm probably not gonna be able to get the entire Kingdom Hearts series done by, uh... You know, the time of King Hearts 3's release. And I want to so badly, but I also want to let's play King Hearts 3, you know? So, um, what I think I'm gonna just have to end up doing is if I don't make it to the end of the series by King Hearts 3's release, I'm just gonna go ahead and play King Hearts 3 and, um, y'all see my, you know, blind reaction to it, even though, you know, y'all won't be completely caught up with the story. I'm sorry, but, you know, it's kind of like, do I just play it by myself or record it and let you guys see my blind reaction? Because trust me, there's probably going to be some, uh, some pretty nice, you know, reactions if I, uh, do it blind, I'm just saying. I thought she was with you. The door is open. What? The door is open, Sora. Now we can go to the outside world. What are you talking about? We've got to find Kyrie. Kyrie's coming with us. Once we step through, we might not be able to come back. We may never see our parents again. There's no turning back. But this may be our only chance. We can't let fear stop us. Are you sure I'm not afraid that? of the darkness. I think we can let fear stop us first. Riku. You know when you get surrounded by darkness, it's probably not a good sign. Just maybe, just maybe not a good sign. So, uh, here's some uh, more fun facts about Kim Hearts. Um, Keith. Keith. Alright. I'm not a hundred percent sure on this, but I think originally Kim Hearts, uh, the main character was going to be either Donald or Nick. Like originally, that was their original plan, and I'm and I think it was Square Enix who said 
No, I think it, it should have its own main character, like its own exclusive main character. So they scrapped the idea of having Mickey or Donald um, as the main character. But if you look at Source Clothing, um, I can't really get. Hold on, you stand up against something. Never mind. Um, I can go through. I'm sorry. I'm trying to find. Either way. Um, point thing is, if you look at his clothing, you can see he has red and yellow and white, you know, all of the colors th that Mickey Mouse has on his clothes. Um, sorry. Um, Mickey Mouse has on his, his, uh, classic clothing, at least. Um, so honestly, you can still see they took inspiration from Mickey Mouse. Um, also... Sora was originally going to be a lion, wielding a chainsaw as his weapon, and Disney, they stepped in and they were like, <laughs> no, 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 not gonna, not quite gonna let that be happening, so they turned, they switched him into a human, and now you get to uh, go around beating shit up with a giant key, <laughs> but uh, honestly, it, I, I will, I'm happy with it. Chainsaw would have been pretty nice, so could you imagine just running around like destroying things with a chainsaw? Like, good lord. Oh. Oh, ready? Oh, I feel like I'm gonna fall off. Which I mean, it's not like it hurts you to fall off, I just don't want to. Come here. Come here. I command you. Or not. Okay. Have a little more time. I'll try and finish uh, Destiny Islands today. It's only a little bit left. Come on, you know, we got some demons to fight. Hey, buddy. Oh, hello. Hello, pal. Come on, pal. So I'm pretty sure it is actually possible to get rid of every heartless on this island, but obviously I'm not gonna make that fit for that. But like everywhere you step there are gonna be heartless like appearing. Could you imagine just going around this entire island getting rid of every single one of them? matter of a few seconds, everything just went to shit. <laughs> oh no, it's our old friend. Uh, I'm pretty sure if you uh, do this right, you can kill him like, before he's even done with his first attack. Okay. But I'm not doing it right. Are you serious? Oh no. Oh, I so I wanted to kill him. Before he's done. Okay, whatever. That's fine. Right. 
Not like he matters that much. There we go. Got him on the spectrum pad. Good enough. So he's really not a problem at all. But that won't stop them from reusing them so many times. See you. Welcome to Traverse Town, everybody. This is totally weird. I'm in another world. Alright, now I think that's going to do it for this episode. Once I get done talking, sit and say, of course. Hey there, how can I? Ah, oh, it's only a kid. I'm not a kid, and the name's Sora. Okay, okay, simmer down. So why the long fix, Sora? You lost or something? No. Well, maybe. Where are we? Huh? Trevor's Town. So, Gramps, is this really another world? Don't call me Gramps! The name's Sid. Anyway, not sure what you're talking about, but this sure ain't your wife. Hmm, guess I'd better start looking for Riku and Kairi. Well, good luck with whatever it is you're doing. If you ever run into trouble, you come to me. I'll look out for you. Well, now I'm gonna steal your shit, so... Boom! <laughs> you ever love that in RPGs? You just go into someone's home and you take all their stuff and they don't do nothing about it? Really? I do believe that'll do it for this episode, as I said. Um, thank you all for watching. Um, hope this was better than the last episode, and uh, uh, I will see you in the next episode. Bye-bye! <laughs>